called? I mean, I've had other album cuts on people, but that's like, that's like the one that came out there and did something. Yeah. I mean, with both of them singing the song, I remember the first time I heard the demo, not the demo, but the, uh, it was like a pre-mix that they let us listen to. We weren't supposed to have the kind of thing, so it's even better than that. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, we played it over at my friend's studio, and just the hair stood up on the back of my arms and my neck, uh, and I just was like, oh, oh my gosh, I can't believe it. Yeah, she came in on that second, I mean, the first chorus, it's just like... Okay, yeah, she's pretty good. <laughs> 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 it sounded so great together, you know. I was really excited when Jason said he wanted to cut the song because I've been such a huge fan of of him, his singing. How he is as an artist is so believable. Like, you can tell that that's who he is up there. You know? When he sings, it sounds real. It's, like, connected. And I'm always looking for that in a singer. And, um, you know, it's just, I can't believe it still, I mean, the song was nominated for Grammy, and they're performing at the Grammy Awards here in February. That's the so cool. I wish I was going. <laughs> <laughs> you can't have everything. I'll set it for what I've got, though. It's just such, I feel so blessed. And literally, like, Nashville is the only place where you can go from playing in bathrooms to writing hit songs in, like, a matter of weeks. And, you know, so that's what it seems like. It's just such a cool, such a cool town. I thought I'd play something off the record right now for you guys. You know, sometimes it's cold outside and you're working in the office and you feel like you're not going in the next morning. That would never I happen give here. You them a song they can listen to, they know that other people feel that way. <laughs> so you know you're not alone, right?